Is it recording? I want to show you my technique on how to use a public restroom with a bidet, electronic bidet seat here. It's a Toto washlet. First thing you want to do is open the lid and um, hold on to your, your camera really tightly. And if you've never used one of these electric bidets. I would recommend not standing over the toilet and pressing buttons to see how it works. It might spray you in the face. So the first thing I want to do is get some toilet paper and um, put it... Oh shit. Fuck. Okay. What you want to do is put some toilet paper on, on, on the seat here because people have cooties. Okay. So you want to... Um, how am I going to do this? Okay, so what you want to do, do your business, and then when you're done, um, sometimes I like to go ahead and, and pre-flush before I do my bidet business because sometimes it's, uh, it's a little too much, you know what I mean? And what I do is take some toilet paper, I switch hands with the camera, and I press, there's a setting here for clean um, wand cleaning, and that, that cleans the wand, or cleans the the bidet wands, toilets, bidet spitter, or, you know, because some, some people, what happens is some people, some people shit, they shit so hard it sputters on the back of the bidet, and that's gross. Or they pee, which I, I hate when people pee standing up when there's an electric day because pee gets all over the back of the, the thing. And um, then I like to put it on the the highest setting. If you've never used one before, I would go with medium or lower than medium. And I do the soft rear cleaning with the, the highest setting. That's why I like. I, I haven't tried the front cleansing one yet, but I do the soft rear with my piece of toilet paper. Because, you know, sometimes when people are peeing standing up, it pisses all over this this little armrest gizmo thing. And I do this for and it goes straight up, and sometimes I wiggle my butt back and forth, you know? And then, um, then I'll stop it. It's, it has a pretty good aim. It's almost like it knows where your, your, your butthole is. You have to sit here for about 20 seconds to let yourself air dry off. Because you're dripping right now. My butthole is dripping um, with the bidet water. And so, um, if I prematurely stand up, all the, the butt water is gonna go all over the place. It's gonna go on the floor, on the toilet, on my, um, on my uh, uh, pants and jeans. Okay, so now, say it's time to, to dry off. What I like to do is, oh shit, I would take a little bit of toilet paper and, and dry off. You do one swipe and it's clean. Your butthole is clean because the bidet did all the work. The next step is to take some more toilet paper and then push off this stuff, okay? Oh, uh, get this. And then you take another piece of toilet paper. Then you take another piece of toilet paper and you you flush the toilet again to get all this stuff. And you karate chop the the lid down so stuff doesn't splash back up. So what you want to do is get some more. Fuck. You want to get a big giant wad of toilet paper. And wrap your your arm around the toilet paper. So what I do is wrap my wrist with toilet paper. So when I go up, I don't touch this nasty um, edge to reach in to get the paper towel paper. Because you know people have like poop on their hands. There. And you do wash your hands. Turn this on. And you get some of this. Get some soap, get some soap in there, wash your hands really well. Then open the door. How do you open the door? Ah, I did it. You put the toilet the paper towel and the toilet paper in the trash. Oh yeah, I forgot that. I need more paper towels. You gotta get the paper towel to turn off the light. Save electricity. 
and to save the environment.